You're doing good, girl. We're stuck in the ship now, Mr. Morgan. In the ship. We're drowning in mud. For a man of the cloth, you have quite a way with words. Words are the very least of my problems. The very least. I'm sure. After Blackwater, we don't want any more deaths. Good evening, Arthur. Evening. You been on the rum again? Anything's button. Let's try something new. Here we go.
Listen, Abigail, you... You deserve so much more than I can manage. Arthur! I guess... We need to talk to you. Oh, it's real easy. What do I do? Pretty much the exact opposite of what you have been. What is it? We got something cooking you might be interested in. Am I gonna like the sound of this? Been cooking since Horseshoe, but you went and kicked up all that commotion in Valentine. Now, we was preparing to rob the bank there until you got involved in all that nonsense, and I don't know, I just feel like it's unfinished business. That wasn't my fault. It was just one of them things. Now, how come every time I get in trouble, I'm called a fool and an idiot? But when you get in trouble, oh, it's just one of them things. <laughs> it's a good point, Arthur. A very good point. All right, well, what do y'all want me to do? Hit the goddamn bank with us. <laughs> you really think it's worth going back there? Four of us can hit the bank easy, but I ain't gonna lie to you. There will be law if we linger. Are they for serious? No, just local boys being rounded up and pressed into action. Meaning? If we go in quick and quiet, we can hit it just fine. If there's four of us, I mean. Y'all think it's worth the risk? It's a bank, Arthur. So? Is the take good? According to the fella I met, yes. It's the end of the stock sales. Plenty of money and plenty of people milling about. <sighs> All right. I suppose it's worth taking a look at least. We should wait until the morning. In any case, I need to change out of these rags if I'm going to be performing. Okay. So, Bill... This better be worth it. Oh, it is. We put a lot of research into this one. I hope so. All right. Let's go. Mr. Morgan. Herr Strauss? That man. The debtor, Thomas Downs, apparently he's dead. Dead? Huh. Well, no, he didn't seem very well. His wife. I believe he has a wife and child. She will assume the debt, of course. Of course. Then you can head up there and collect. Be lent them a lot of money. Okay. Gentlemen, let's go rob ourselves a bank. What's the plan, then? Oh, well, we're gonna send Karen on in ahead as a uh, distraction. Then we're just gonna rush on in afterwards. Just a small bank in a little town. Nothing that big in way of security. We just need to bring you along as a uh, insurance policy. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> okay, let's move. Oh, 
And did Dutch tell you I've also been cooking up some deals with them gray boys? What? No. What kind of deals? See? You don't realize, Morgan. I'm out there putting in the work same as you. I've been drinking with them a couple times now. Seems they're looking for some extra security. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Could be something in it for us. Well, just be smart about it. We got a lot of irons in that fire right now. Yes, I know, Morgan. Glad you and Lenny are alone for this, Karen. Someone's got to keep you boys out of trouble. I ain't sure even Lenny can be relied on to keep his head. Not after that night you two had in Valentine. Yeah, I've been trying to forget that. What little I remember of it. You've always been a bad drunk. And before you say it, I know. It takes one to know one. Guess we'll never learn. And Bill ain't much better. So should we stop for some whiskey? How about we wait till after the bank, all right? So, how are you feeling about this, Lenny? Well, at first I thought it was a bad idea. But then I figured <laughs> they all are if you think about them long enough. Certainly have been recently. I mean, why the hell not? Roll with it. I just told him we needed you along. Uh, I appreciate the confidence, Kent. And if we didn't rob this bank, we really would be slipping. Thoughts like that. And you're one. Are you all right, Arthur? So you talking about thoughts like that. And you're one of us, no doubt. Talking about something? Sure, I hope so. That day to All right. Guess we're doing this then. All right, follow me. So, what's the idea here? Karen going to distract him? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. She makes one of her scenes, catch him off guard, then we move in. Make one of her scenes? Charming. I'll have you know I'm a professional. Is that so? She is. Feel good. I can give you drunken harlot, of course. Lost little girl. Whatever the crowd. What about a lost little drunk girl? Only you would want that. Then me and Lenny will deal with the guards and the customers while you hit the vault. I thought you only brought me for insurance. All right. I'll hit the vault. No, no. I got it. Glad you and Lenny are alone for this, Karen. Someone's got to keep you boys out of trouble. I ain't sure even Lenny can be relied on to keep his head. Not after that night you two had in Valentine. Yeah, I've been trying to forget that. What little I remember of it. You've always been a bad drunk. And before you say it, I know. It takes one to know one. Guess we'll never learn. And Bill ain't much better. So should we stop for some whiskey? <laughs> How about we wait till after the bank, all right? I can't believe you got me going back to Valentine. Don't tell me it ain't hurt you leaving that bank behind. Not really. Work a town and not hit the bank? <laughs> That's downright pathetic. I guess we went a bit beyond working it. We shot the place to hell. You did, Morgan. Not me. I played it cool up there. Couple of punch-ups, dealt with some old Driscolls, Oh, is that right? Like I said, you mess up is just one of them things. I mess up. I'm the prize idiot. Well, Bill, 
I don't know what to tell you. Surprised you ain't already ripped me about that dynamite again. One mistake, and I'll never live it down. What do you need? A pat on the back? A medal? Just know, I got the lead on this one. We'll see about that once things get going. So, how are you feeling about this, Lenny? Well, at first I thought it was a bad idea. But then I figured they all are if you think about them long enough. Certainly have been recently. I mean, why the hell not? Roll with it. I just told him we needed you along. I appreciate the confidence, Kip. And if we didn't rob this bank, we really would be slipping. Thoughts like that? And you're one of us, no doubt. Sure hope so. All right. Guess we're doing this then. Passing you. Okay. Keep it down now. We're here. Easy. Coming past. Sure. Hey, mister. Good morning to you. Behind you. After you. Howdy. Ain't you done pawing around in trouble? Good morning. Howdy. here off the main drag. All right, gentlemen. Here we are. Okay. Get ready. Karen, go to work. Of course. All right. Keep it cool and follow me, fellas. decided. Is it lost little girl you want, or the drunken harlot? Uh, of course, you know I like the harlot. You're the only one. You're a bunch of filthy sinners and the heartbreakers, Zolotia. <laughs> now, where is he? If you're ready, get going. Good luck, gentlemen. We got this. Until she's gone real down. Are you? Gone like you don't know me. Oh. Suffering here. Not so goddamn stuck up last night. Oh, sorry. Just between us. I I've never seen this woman in my life. Get your goddamn right, hands up! Go. This is a goddamn robbery! Nobody move! Get word up! Nobody move! Don't make us hurt you! Here! Unlock the door! Oh, you think oh, we're here to fail? Come on. Oh, 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 open oh, the goddamn vault! Oh, oh, open it! No! Oh, oh.
I'm in. Someone come make sure the suit behaves himself in here. Come here. <laughs> Open the lock boxes now. I, uh, the, the, the manager does that. Uh, I. God damn it! Now what? Guess I'll crack them or blow them up. Keep an eye out. I'll be as quick as I can. Yeah, I think I should be able to crack these. All right, but you uh, better be quick. <clears throat> you shut the hell up and stay still. I can. This is slower, but it's quieter. Okay. I hear people out there. Me too. Boys, need to move this along. Hey, watch him there. Don't worry. I see him. That's another one cleared. This is looking good. How much longer? Nearly there. Okay, you reckon that's enough now? Maybe. It's never enough. Well, I am ready to get the hell out of here whenever you are. We gotta move. Ah! I think... Uh, I think we're fine. Come on, I'll lead the way. Let's go. Everybody, stay calm. All of you count to a hundred and keep your mouth shut. You understand me?
I think we lost him. Thank you, gentlemen. That was... Stupid and dangerous. Thank you, Bill. We're alive and we're paid. Yeah. I don't see the problem. Yeah, and that is the problem. <laughs> Bill, <laughs> this you. is a very good take. That you'll be happy, even if it did come with a heap of trouble. Ah, it was fun. <laughs> well, maybe you're right. Now, go on, get out of here. I have some other business to attend to. Don't head directly back to camp, and make sure you ain't followed. <sighs> okay. Yep. This is Downs. My husband's not cold in the ground, and you've come back here. Archie, I nearly paid off what was owed. Your husband knew the rules when he took that money. Now, I'm real sorry about the way things turned out, but he had a choice. Ain't my fault about the way the world is. He didn't have a choice. He was good, and he did good. There wasn't no choice in that. And you've as good as killed him yourself, and don't kid yourself. You had a choice. You speak as if killing was something I cared about. You ever wonder about eternity? You should. I hope it's hot and terrible, Mrs. Downs. Otherwise, I'll feel I've been sold a false bill of goods. Now, please, give me that money. <sighs> Either you got a lazy eye or lack of respect. Which is it, boy? I ain't got no lazy eye. No respect for the lacks of you. <sighs> well, maybe when your mother's finished mourning your father, I'll keep her in black, on your behalf. You think on that, boy? Well, maybe you shall, sir. And maybe other events will transpire. You best stick to them books, because mark my words on this. Vengeance is an idiot's game. Ah, Mrs. Downs, thank you for your punctuality. It's next to godliness, isn't it? That's cleanliness. I'll have to take your word on that. Good day.
Evening, Arthur. Good evening, Arthur. Let's go. Get that horse away from here. Okay, okay. Keep your hair on.
Good girl. Yeah. Be right there. Well, hello again. I got another one. You interested? So, uh, do you want this, Arthur? Can you believe I just heard one of them demand equal treatment to us whites? Right here for you, when you're ready. All right, well, come back if you change your mind. Every time.
been too many Federals coming through. <laughs> Stop right where you are. to our place. I got away, but they got my wife. Please, mister. I gotta do something. All right. Where is she? It's a sack out in the swamp by the water. <laughs> okay. Go on. See if you can find the law. I'll do what I can. Uh, I'll go about finding more help. Sorry I weren't here sooner. Oh, 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 thank the Lord you showed up when you did. <sighs> you saved my honor. Christ, what a mess. Would you please You're get them out right of here? Now, I can't so stand to touch them. And I don't want Let's hope my Horace found another guardian angel like you. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's some money I put away in the sack there. It ain't enough, but please take it. Appreciate it. Good luck to you. Let's go, girl. Sorry, but without the papers, I can't pay you full price. Came to the right shop today, that I guarantee. High quality, keep it simple. You won't go wrong. Okay, let's go switch them. Come back anytime. I'm always happy to stable. 
Devin lost a horse him. That fool can never remember the lost his barn door. <laughs> well, please, take a seat. Only a trim or something fancy like? Mighty fine if I do say so. Makes a man look ten years younger. Thank you. Looks okay. All right, you're ready to go. Don't wash it for a day. Well, hey. How you doing today? I don't even know where to start telling you. Since I'm so tired. 